going on, YouTube community? It's your boy, Wild Gym Blog TV, coming straight out of Cincinnati, Ohio. Now, in this video, I'm going to talk about Michael Porter Jr. Got an extension from the Denver Nuggets. He just got the bag. He got a nice big bag. Five-year contract extension worth up to $207 million. Man, oh, man. Now, some people may be like, damn, is he, is he getting overpaid? Is he worth it? Um... I think he showed this season that he's worth it. I mean, um, you know, coming off the, you know, the injuries that he has throughout his career so far, short career so far, I think this season he showed up and stepped up a lot due to the fact that Jamal Murray was out, you know, with his ACL injury. I think it was, yeah, his ACL injury. So he stepped up pretty big. Um, this season he averaged 19.7.3 rebound per game while shooting 40. 44% from the three-point line. Um, so he kind of had a more of a responsibility in this off offense since Jamal Murray is gone. And also we know Porter, you know, he's a pretty he's a pretty good defender. He can defend pretty good. And he showed a lot this season and in the postseason that, you know, he he we see the potential. If he just keep growing and keep elevating, we see what he can do. So I'm looking forward to see what he does this season. Uh Jamal Murray, he should be back. I uh, don't know when he's gonna come back, but um I think, you know, I, I I don't know if he's worth two hundred and five, but hey, man, the way they can throw out this money now in the NBA is just is is, is just crazy. But from what I'm reading, I'm going to read the whole details in Woj. Um, it says Denver Nugget four Michael Porter Jr. has agreed to a five year designated max extension that could be that could be up worth up to two hundred seven million. Um, Porter deal is worth one hundred and seventy two million unless he reaches the designated max criteria. And makes one of the three all NBA teams this season. Okay, so if he make okay, so it's incentives he has to make to get the whole potential, the whole max. He would have to you know make the the all uh, one of the three all NBA teams this season. So okay, that makes sense. So at the end of the day, it's still a nice contract extension or whatever you know. So um, I think he's this is good for him and the Denver Nuggets because the Denver Nuggets, believe it or not, they have a great ass team. You know they have a great, a great, great, good, good ass team. And when Jamal Murray come back, he's gonna obviously, probably, hopefully he can get back to where he was at in rare form. You know before the the injury. But I think this is um I don't know if he's overpaid. I can't say because money is just growing a lot so much. So I can't really say if he's overpaid. It looked like he's overpaid because you know he hasn't no all star appearances, none of that stuff. So I can understand how people might be like. Wow, they just gave him a lot of money. You know, I, I, I can understand that. But, uh, hey, man, they wanted to make sure that they keep him. They don't want to lose him. And that's, that is, you don't want to lose somebody like that. And he mess around and fucking go to the Lakers. <laughs> but anyway, guys, tell me what you think about this. Do you think they overpaid Michael Porter Jr. or do he deserve it? Comment, subscribe, favorite, like, share. Check out my previous videos. Hit me up on all my social media sites. Make sure you hit the notification bell, guys. And I'm out. Deuces.